This is the hardest downhill event in the world. The Strife is part of the Hanukkah races, located in the Kitzbühel Alps in Austria. The Hanukkah race weekend is a series of annual winter competitions, including the downhill and the Super G events on the Strife. The Strife is one of the oldest ski races in the world. It's been part of the Kitzbühel history since the ski club held its first Hanukkah race in 1931. Usually, the Hanukkah race weekend attracts 90,000 visitors each year, while more than 300 million around the world tune in to watch the races on TV. Now let's take a look at what makes this the most extraordinary and difficult downhill event in the world. Although the route is distinct and unique every year, there are a few reoccurring characteristics that competitors face. It's 3,312 meters long, which is about the length of 32 football fields and has a maximum slope of 40.4 degrees. It would be a black diamond run on a trail, some of the most challenging mountain slopes. In other words, it's insanely steep and challenging. The skiers reach speeds of 140 kilometers at the steepest section. That's quicker than the vast majority of speed limits on the world's highways. The top 30 seconds are what set the strife apart from other World Cup races. You have no chance to settle into the race. Starting at 1,665 meters into a 51% gradient descent, accelerating from zero to 60 kilometers per hour in less than three seconds. It's considered one of the most technical courses that drives the athletes off track. They have to battle to stay in line while forced to endure G-forces of 3.1 Gs before crossing the finish line. <laughs> to put on an event like this, a core team that entails about 10 people work year round in demanding conditions to create a course that truly challenges the world's top skiers. There is no guide for making the strife, the team has a lot of experience, knowledge, and intuition that they use to make the course. Preparing the slopes is extremely difficult because the terrain is so steep, but the staff have been active on the mountain for years, knowing all conceivable situations and scenarios. Since the strife's inception, much has changed, such as the use of equipment to prepare the slopes and the introduction of artificial snow. Depending on weather conditions, water is injected to make the snow compact and harder. The team lay down 10 kilometers of safety netting along the course to prevent athletes from any fatal crashes. Nowadays, there must be a consistent foundation and this needs to have a certain depth to ensure the obligatory drill length for the race flags. During race weekend, a team of 1,500 people work around the strife, working 24 hour days, making sure everything runs smoothly. If a blizzard arrives, staff may be required to clear the track throughout the night. If the weather does not cooperate, an outdoor mountain event like this may well be delayed or even canceled. That's why the Hanukkah race crew must be prepared to work around the clock to ensure the world's most extraordinary ski event runs smoothly. 